All right. Shalom, shalom. All praises, honor, and glory. It goes to Yahweh Bahashim, Yahweh Shai Bahashim Rakakradash. Double honors to the apostles, double honors to the elders of Great Millstone. Yahweh Bahashim Yahweh Shai, broke a thumb to the hopeful elect. Shalom, shalom. Today is going to be a morning in transit. <clears throat> morning in transit. Going into being in, in incognito. <laughs> you know, tips for being incognito. You know, brothers, you know, we, we usually refer refer to this as keeping your Clark Kent game. You know, being a being a Clark Kent out here. Cause you know Clark Kent, that's the uh that's the disguise of Superman. When Superman wasn't doing his Superman shit, he was disguised as a, a news reporter named Clark Kent. So it was like he lived a, a a double life, as you will say. And um, and the truth, that's that's the same way we gotta live, especially in these times now, with you know the uh, political intensity in the United States. You know, a lot of people are are on opposing sides. You know, a lot of people have different ideologies, and it's getting to the point people are becoming violent behind their ideologies, man. So. You know, this ain't this ain't the time to be wearing uh, fringes to work. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? This ain't the time to be wearing fringes to work. This ain't the time to be telling your next door neighbor you an Israelite. You know, this ain't the time to be screaming at your boss that he's he's a he's a fucking Edomite and he gonna be destroyed, man. Nah, now we in the time of uh, being circumspect. You know, we in the time of just knowing knowing how to move. And really just living living the prophesy another day, man, because when you when you look back at history, going into the time of, uh, of the Romans, it was it was pretty much illegal to call yourself a Christian. If they found out you was a so-called Christian, they, they would kill you, man. And, you know, that's that's not the only ins instance in the Bible where, you know, you couldn't show your faith for thing and how about Shemel Shah. But, you know, that that's the one coming off the top of my head right now. So when this when this society turns turns back into that spirit to where, you know, they don't want nobody calling themselves Israelites, they don't want nobody saying the names of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. You gonna have to know how to move in those days, man. You know? I think of the Apostle Paul. The Apostle Paul was like sneaking in the cities to to uh to teach. You know, he wasn't out there, he wasn't out there on the on the uh, forefronts, you know, it really turned into like a uh secret house ministry you know really like like real private real low-key to the point where you know motherfuckers was trying to get after him he had he had to sneak sneak he had to sneak through the back window man <laughs> you see so yeah man you know the way 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 i think of it i mentioned this before in some videos but you know you, you really got to see yourself as a secret agent for your how about shimao shah man you know what I'm saying? James Bond, he ain't no, he, he don't, he don't be telling everybody his, his full name is James Bond. Sometimes he go by Bond. Sometimes he go by 007. Sometimes he just say his name is James, man. <laughs> you see, so you gotta, you gotta keep that certain level of mystery about yourself when you deal with these people uh, in the world, man. So I got a few tips I'm gonna go into. I can't really pull no precepts, like, cause you know, obviously this is an in transit. But I still wanted to uh, get 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 this lesson out. So you know, the first tip is uh, you using a using a alias name, like like I say with James Bond. You know, he ain't always giving out his full name wherever he at, and that's the same thing with brothers, man. Like you really should be putting putting your your real full name out there in the streets, just because you don't you don't know who these people know. You know what I'm saying? Because out here in Kansas City, like this, this, this ain't, this is not a big fucking place. So, we, 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 we have to put in the effort to be in, 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 incognito, man. We have to put in the effort to uh, keep, keep a low profile because, once again, it, 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 if you, if you don't, you could be easily recognized. Like cities like Houston, shit, niggas, <laughs> niggas, niggas, two miles away will fucking forget about you. They, <laughs> niggas, two miles away don't even recognize you, man. But you know, for certain aspects, uh, you know, it's different. So, like I say, ha having an alias name, you know what I'm saying? Like, don't don't be giving these chicks your your full first and last name unless you 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 fully trust them. If it's like a shorty you 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 first meeting, she don't need to know all that shit, man. 
If it's if it's a fucking nigga at the bar, he don't need to know all that shit. If it's some some nigga at the gas station, they don't need to know all that shit, man. You know, so develop develop uh you know, alias, man. You know, brother <laughs> Think of some cool shit like fucking ghost, man. <laughs> You know that's 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 really how we move out there. We don't we don't really be be putting all that all that government info out there because it could easily come back to you, especially if you know if you run into agents and shit like that. They could they could easily look 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 they could easily look look that shit up, man. Now the second point I got is is do not be a regular. You know don't be a regular, which means that uh you don't you don't want to get too comfortable having any routine or going to like certain places routinely you see what i'm saying like the first one i'm gonna I'm bring up is like going going to a bar or going to your little weekend spot you know you don't want to be going to the to the same spot now everybody know your name the bartender already know what type of drink you want you know eventually it's gonna come to the time nigg niggas is gonna be expecting you and that's hey that that's 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 a dire mistake because you know, if somebody really wanted to uh, do you in, they 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 go they gonna know where to find you, man. So obviously we got you know routine things that we do, but it's good to have alternate spots. It's good to switch things up. Like like me, if I if I if I go to a weekend spot, I may not I may not go there for a whole another three weeks because I don't want to be a regular. See, I it's, it's other places to go, other things to do. But when you out there and people is recognizing your face, hey, you don't, you don't, you you don't, you don't really want that. You know, you don't really want that. Now, me, I, uh, another another thing that I do, this ain't like mandatory, but you know, I go I go to uh, different gyms. I don't I don't be going to the I don't be going to the same gym throughout the week. You know, I got the uh, Planet Fitness Black Card or whatever. So when you got the Black Card, you can go to any Planet Fitness in the country. So, being honest, I rotate between uh, six six different Planet Fitnesses. <laughs> but hey, that that's just me. You know, that's just me. I don't I don't want to be too recognizable, and I don't want to be too predictable, because once again, we live in a small city, and you know, any, any anything can happen. You know, anything can happen. But the the third point I got is uh, knowing knowing who you bring to your house, man. Knowing to you knowing who you bring to your house. Obviously, this is more more uh towards brothers <laughs> brothers who got who got their own place you know who be out there you know trying to trying to trying to trying to get their daily bread brother <laughs> you know you out there trying to get you a daily bread when it when it come to come to a female and whatnot now you know i ain't gonna lie we had instances where you know it'd be short 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 notice you know what i'm saying you know you may you you may meet a chick you ain't you don't really know her that long and you just hey say fuck it bring it back to the crib but you know once again now in these days you gotta be a little bit more uh circumspect especially when it comes to dealing with women like like one one show i like to watch a lot is first 48 <laughs> you know we all know that show first 48 you know on a uh, on a uh, and e but We'll get we'll get a lot of niggas hemmed up on the first 48 is 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 the fucking women they dealing with. Not just first 48, but you know, I'll be watching cops and shit too. You know, when niggas get pulled over, they gonna separate you. They gonna put the man on one side and they gonna put the woman on one side. Who gonna snitch? The woman. The woman is gonna start babbling. Same thing at first 48. They gonna they gonna they gonna they they are they are gonna put your girl in a in an interrogation room under under a uh, harsh scrutiny <laughs> they're gonna put her under they're gonna put her under harsh scrutiny questioner and hey man let's just just expect 10 times out of 10 she gonna fold unless unless she a righteous woman and you know she believing in how about she may shy she may have some integrity on her but if it's if, if it's some bitch in the world hey bro 10 out of 10 she gonna fold so that's why I say, you know, just just be like conscious, not not just who you bring into your home, but who you bring into your life, and have an expectation that whatever I tell this bitch, she she is gonna flip and tell Esau, like this bitch is not on my side. 
I don't care, you know, you know, you know me, what I'm gonna say. I don't care how good the box is. I don't care how good the mouth and lip service is. I don't care if she's sending you fucking new pictures every day, man. You gotta, you gotta expect this bitch to portray you, man. So, you know, obviously go, go, go through a vetting process, ask questions, whatever you gotta do. You know, me, like, I don't just be picking up chicks. I, <laughs> I try. <laughs> I try not to just be picking up chicks on some on some one night shit. You know, I usually, you know, if, if if I meet a shorty out, I at least wanna have a uh have a sit down. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> have a sit down, chop it up, and see and see what this what what this woman is about, and then go from there, man. Because if you if you just if you just so quick to letting chicks in your house, you really just letting 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 fucking dragons in. And, and and this and this chick may like she may she may play a role to seem like she cool, but then you gonna get comfortable. You gonna get comfortable with her being at your crib, and it's gonna be a fucking annoyance. You gonna be like, nah, I should I should have never fuck with this bitch. So yeah, that's <laughs> that's another point. Another point too is uh uploading pictures to the internet. You know, now, I ain't saying you know you can't you can't put out a selfie for the bitches because we all do that. But I'm speaking more like a personal things like like you don't you don't want you don't really want to upload your car too much. You know, obviously, Jake, we want to we want to show it off. But you got to be, you know, conscious of what you're doing. Like like you definitely don't want to be uploading your, your fucking license plate on the Internet. You know, and, and really, see, I don't I don't I don't have kids, so I can't really tell brothers what kids to do. But. You know, I would, I would I would consider posting images about your uh, posting images with your kids because, hey, we dealing with the devil here. You know, we dealing with the devil, and and this devil is is gonna come. He's gonna come at. He's going to come at every angle to get to the man of the Lord, man. So even if it come with your kids, so you know, if you can find images of your kids online, the devil could run that. Run, run it into a system, you know. All you gotta do is, is, is use your government name. Next thing you know, you going to you going to pick up your kid at preschool, and they and they say somebody already grabbed. Him. What the fuck? See, or you know, your kids be outside, and a fucking white 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 minivan pull up, and gone. Now I ain't, I'm not wishing that on brothers. You know, I definitely don't wish that on brothers. I I, I pray that every every brother's family stays safe, but. You know, once again, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta consider every situation because once again, this is the devil. This nigga is, this nigga is is highly unpredictable, and he is very cruel to the things that he will do to get to get to a man of the Lord, man. So this is why it's important to be in incognito, man. You know, another thing, last point I'm gonna get is 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 just oversharing in general, oversharing in general. No, I, I was having a conversation with a brother. This 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 a while ago. We were, we were at a uh, at a bar or whatnot, and we were having like a spiritual conversation. You know, we were talking about some Israelite stuff. But you know, the brother, you know, he he kind of got a he kind of got a loud speaking voice. So the dude sitting next to us at the bar was like overhearing what we were saying, and he ended up joining the conversation. Like, yeah, I I, I know I'm an Israelite X Y and Z. And, you know, I kind of pulled the brother to the side. I'm like, okay, like, you got to be circumspect because either, yeah, he, he could he could be he could be a sincere man or he could be an agent. You see what I'm saying? Because you got to automatically assume all of your texts are written, all of your phone calls are recorded, man. It's just, 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 just like the fucking wire. You see what I'm saying? So... Not not just in public situations, you don't want to be oversharing. But once again, going 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 back to these women, man. Every every bitch don't 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 need to know your fucking life story. Every bitch don't need to know your fucking favorite color, man. And definitely every bitch does not need to know what 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 you are out there doing on on what are you out there doing on Saturday afternoons, man. <laughs> you see? Now once again, these these are these are just tips that you know, I I try to practice. You know, if brothers got any any other tips, but you know, this is all prophetic because you know the persecution is written about. See what I'm saying? The persecution of the church is written about. Yeah, how would y'all say if, if they if they do not accept you 
flee ye into another city, man. Which means you gotta dip up out of there. You gotta keep a low profile, man. For the for the, for, for for the word, for the word and the name of the Lord's sake, man. It's not always out there, you know, where 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 your fringes to work. Talking about what's your nationality, brother? <laughs> what's your nationality? Do you know your nationality? And here you is at work on your fucking nine to five. Trying to trying to get Jake to understand that they they are of the uh, tribe of Judah, man. See that that shit gonna backfire on a lot of niggas, man. You see, so once again, it, it's best to keep a low profile. Hey, really, really being being all mysterious and shit. I ain't gonna lie, that that really make the chicks more more interested in you, like on some real shit. Like when you ain't really. When you not really like like a fucking open book like that, and you you not telling every bitch your every feeling and and, and and like every thought you got in your mind, they 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 gonna, they gonna like that shit. Now now she gonna say she gonna tell you, oh I just I just hate it. You're just so closed off. Oh I just hate it. You just you just so hard to read. Which when 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 a woman says when a woman says she actually hates something, that means she is intrigued and she is excited by it. See what I'm saying? So really, like, don't don't ever don't ever get that up, man. Like, keep keep that mysterious part about you. Not 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 just for not just for the bitches, but for like for like the ministry sake, man. Because it's about to get real hectic out here. But with that, you know, Lord willing, this edifying, all praises, honor, and glory it goes to Yahweh Baha Shem, Yahweh Shai, Baha Shem Dash. Double honors to the apostles, double honors to the elders of Great Millstone. Yeah, how about you, man? I'll shot, bracket, thumbs, and old full leg. Shalom, shalom.